Hi there, we are back for another episode of Shadowbringers and we follow up with the main scenario quests. We are here in Raktika Greatwood at x 20.7, y 28.1, z minus 0.2 and we have to talk to Ishtola. Stirring up trouble, level 74 quest. Ishtola seems quite pleased with herself, but whether she has good or bad news, to share remains to be seen. Let me begin by first explaining the origins of this tablet. I initially believed it might detail the history of the Church of the First Light. Much to my surprise, it dates back to the end of the Roncan Empire and was likely written under the direction of the reigning ruler. It was a time of strife and unceasing war with neighboring nations. With each passing day, they yielded more and more territory to their enemies. In their desperation, petitions for aid were sent out to their allies. This was one such petition. And you think this ancient petition will somehow help us to get into Ixmaya? Indeed, we do. For etched into this tablet is a method by which one may prove themselves an ally of the Ronkan Empire. Provided we are able to decipher said instructions, we may entreat the ruins protectors to grant us safe passage. The problem, however, is I presently lack the resources to decipher them in their entirety. We have but one resource. There exists a stone monument inscribed with ancient Ronkan text and translations into a more modern dialect which came into use after the fall of the Empire. I am confident it will suit our purposes. Where can we find this monument? Here in Sitia, quite close to Slitherbo, in fact. The good news ends there, however, for it is in the procession of a rather radical faction of dark worshippers, the children of the everlasting dark. Uh, if I am to study the monument, I must infiltrate their encampment. I have no intention of taking longer than absolutely necessary, but I will nevertheless require time to transcribe the text I need. To ensure that I will have enough, I ha I'm afraid I must ask you and Sangrid to assist me. And before you even ask, the answer is no. If we are to remain unseen, our group must be as small as, as, small as possible. Alright, I'll stay here until you return. He won't be long. If anything should happen, you keep her safe. Then let us convene outside, to the west of Slitherbo, and where the past diverges. The encampment we seek is to the north, but it would be foolish to simply rush in. A guard has been posted at Cleric to keep watch over the children. Perhaps he has ought to share of their recent activity. But we must treat it carefully. There is a chance we may encounter them along the way. Stay close and stay alert. I would avoid a confrontation if possible. 
they rejoice in dealing death to others, claiming that in doing so they cleanse their victims of sin and usher them unto the sunless sea. I would rather not sully my hands defending myself against such madmen. By the blessed dog. Thank goodness you are unharmed. We would have arrived sooner, but we too had a rather unwel unwelcome visit from the children. You are an acquaintance of Master Matoya, yet then, my apologies. The children have been acting strange of late, so I sought to take a closer look. I was careless. Strange, what have you seen? At first there seemed to be nothing out of the ordinary, the usual gathering of ingredients and for poisons from fauna and animals. But then I took notice of their venomous spiders. They've been breeding them in much greater numbers. It's as if they are preparing for something. Any ideas as to what? I could, it could be anything really, uh, if I meant the end of the blessed, nothing would be too cruel or violent for them. But perhaps we can use their present preoccupation with spiders to our advantage. If we were to introduce a treat to the nests where they keep them, the children would be compelled to save them. Bees, for example, are a natural predator of the spiders set them loose on the nests and we would have our opportunity to sneak into their encampment. What a mischievous plan, I like it. With a bit of smoke we should be able to subdue a few colonies long enough to secure their hives. Have you anything we might be able to use? We should have smoke bombs at the outpost just over there. That is, then it's settled. Grab a few smoke bombs from the outpost and search about the, for beehives. I imagine the bees won't take too kindly to your visit, but once they are knocked out, they take the beehives and bring them back here. Two will suffice, I should think.
Ah, sim. Não. Não? Ah, ok, eu tenho que fazer isso em um segundo. Talk. Help me, please. The guard returned to Slitherbow, but not before offering his thanks. As for the beehives, Tancred and I were successful in acquiring what we need. How did you fare? This is more than enough. The children are certain to be displeased. Let us hurry before the bees begin to stir. Okay. That was it for this episode. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next episode. Bye bye.